Hi friends, I am Bulin. Welcome to mytechbits.com, a collection of my technical bits and pieces of information, online tools, calculators and converters. In this session, I will provide you the steps to be taken to allow multiple remote desktop session for a Windows user. By default, Windows Server 2008, 2012 and Windows 7 or 10 are set to allow only a single session for an user through remote desktop. But sometimes you may need to allow multiple remote desktop sessions for a single user at the same time. For allowing concurrent single user session, you need to change the terminal server settings in the registry on the server. To change the registry settings in Windows 10, go to search, type in regedit. The regedit app link will be listed above the search box. Click the regedit to launch the registry editor. In the registry editor, go to HK Local Machine, System, Current Control Set, Control, and Terminal Server. On selecting the Terminal Services registry, you can see the registry key F single session per user on the right panel. If the key is not available, then create a new key by right-clicking Terminal Services and select New D Word. In my case, the key is already available, so I am going to edit it. To edit, double-click the key to launch the edit screen. In the edit screen, change the value from 1 to 0. The value 1 means single session for each user and 0 means multiple session for each user. Now you can click OK and restart the computer for the new settings to take effort. If you like this video session, do subscribe my channel and share it with your friends. Also join us in social networks like Facebook and Google+. For more technical articles, online tools, calculators and converters, check out my website mytechbits.com M-Y-T-E-C-B-I-T-S dot com See you again with some more interesting technical sessions. Until then, bye-bye.